Lopez. All right, welcome back to the show. Ladies and gentlemen, when it comes to quality entertainment, accept no imitations. Unless the imitations are coming from Julie Cardoza and Corbell, the imitating bird. Hello. Very nice to meet you. You got the bird matches your shirt, That's which right. matches your eyes, the whole green thing. Uh, and you're from San Jose, man. What, That's what do you right. Do up there? Well, I'm a mom of a seven-year-old daughter named Olivia, oh, and great. I love animals, pets, and especially parrots. Oh, that's a beautiful parrot. What kind Thank of you. Parrot is it? Uh, this is a yellow named Amazon, and of course his name is Corbell. Mm -hmm. Where did you get Corbell? Actually, Corbell came from a broken home. Yeah, he, uh, yeah. Like um, many of us, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was actually uh, a couple was getting divorced, so we ended up adopting him. My husband and I take care of him. Okay. So he has a pretty good life. And he's going to do some impressions for us. Yeah, he does some pretty neat things. He can uh, do animal sounds. He can actually sing opera and cry like a baby. Oh, yeah. my gosh. <laughs> any regrets for any of the... Uh... He's just having a good old funny he, time. He's funny, too. Yeah, yeah, he is. <laughs> Is there anything you showed, you taught him that well, regret? Well, actually, I didn't teach him. Our daughter, uh, who's seven years old now, uh, when she was a young baby, like any baby, she'd cry when she mm -hmm. needed something. And this bird picked up on that crying. So this bird will just continue crying and crying and crying. And oh, my The baby gosh. will stop, but the bird will keep going. Oh, how funny. Oh, oh yeah, I'm funny. Just, uh, yucking it up right now. So, <laughs> Spotlight you. is yours anytime you want. Okay. Oh, well, everyone, this is Corbell, and uh, he... He also not laughs, but he also says his name. He likes to talk uh -huh. a little bit. Yeah, what's your name? Uh -huh. That's right. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, now, Corbell loves to do animal sounds, so he's going to do a few for you. Uh, the first one he's going to do is the sound of a rooster. So you ready? Do a, do a cock a doo doo <laughs> is really really scary so don't don't be scared okay it's a ferocious no it's not, not yet not yet it's a, i'm talking about this no don't cough don't, he's not really sick he's just making that up it's it's a ferocious guard dog all right are you ready can you bark oh, oh. <laughs> now here's an last one but it kind of needs the audience help if you don't mind uh you have to make the sound and judges can help out too you got to make the sound and then he'll copy you so everyone has to make the sound of a coyote howling at the moon. Come on, everybody. You ready? Oh. Oh. Good job. Good job. Thank you. Right. Now he does some human sounds, too. We've all had one of those, okay? And he does a sore throat, too. Ready? Go. Okay. And now he's going to sing, all right? He loves to sing. And it's... Yay! Yay! Okay, let's do him cry. The commensal cry won't make that let's one. Let's do cry. Let's do the cry. Can you cry? 